Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Rajas Kakasungura YouTube channel. We are at 111,000 subscribers. A great milestone that I will never take for granted. I'm here because you are there. The support you are granting this platform is amazing. And I'm extremely happy and nashkuru uh, sana. I want to assure Kenyans, wherever you are, that uh, the vetting process in Parliament, just like the other time, was meant to waste our time on the screens. It was meant to entertain us Kenyans. It was meant to give us a show of might and wealth that uh, the CS nominees have. The vetting exercise to me cannot be useful or will not be useful to the people of the Republic of Kenya who have been yearning for quality service delivery. It is a decoy. It is a painted way of sanitizing the rotten people. Yani, I don't know how to explain this until you get it. I am saying this because of the nature of the questions that were being asked. To me, all the CS nominees, when you look at the mood of those asking the questions and the mood of those responding, it's crystal clear some people were coached on how to respond. And uh, it seems some people were given those questions all in advance. Wakambiwa, expect A, B, C, D. When you are coming. I want to take. Like 27 seconds. To angaria this particular video. You watch it very keenly. I'll come back to share the results. Has, are you aware if any of uh, your former colleagues or staff at the county government of Kakamega. Have recorded any statements uh, with ESEC. And lastly, has the office of the D ODPP, office of the <laughs> Director of Public Prosecutions, ever contacted you in relation to this matter or uh, uh, prosecuted you? Uh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't know. Ladies and gentlemen, that video is Kimani Ichungwa asking weekly from Best of Paran a question. If you didn't notice anything, let me give you a leakage. As you watch that video, I want you to keenly observe Junet Muhammad. <laughs> Very keenly. Nataka uangalia Junet Muhammad. Angalia vile anafanya. We achano na ichungwa. Just focus on Junet Muhammad. I want to replay that video again. And then I'll come back. Has, are you aware if any of uh, your former colleagues or staff at the county government of Kakamega have recorded any statements uh, with ESEC? And lastly, has the office of the D ODPP, office of the <laughs> Director of Public Prosecutions, ever contacted you in relation to this matter or uh, uh, prosecuted you? Uh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't know. Ladies and gentlemen, from that video clip alone, it tells us that the CS nominees were being coached. If you keenly observed Junet Muhammad, when Ichungwa is asking Wycliffe Oparanya whether he's aware of the case of the corruption case at the ESCC, Junet is signaling Oparanya. Yani, in real sense, Junet is telling Oparanya, mm -mm, yo kata. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And he's doing this three times. Ta 
matters what? The whole vetting exercise cannot give us credible results. And uh, they are doing this just because the constitution says they should do it. Now, Wakenya skiza. There is no CS nominee from the list is going to be discredited by the vetting comes. Trust me. Wale wato wamekuwa vetted, watapita. And they will be awarded high marks. I saw this from the beginning. And uh, it was bound to happen. And the third is how it was calculated. Akuna CS nomini from that vetting committee. Anenda kwangu kamatiani. All of them were coached. Even those who were previously in the cabinet were coached. That's why unaona. Okiangalia wale walikuwa kwa cabinet last time. At least. Their income has increased by either 1 mi 100 million, 150 million to the highest 200. That is the range. Eh? Hapo ndiyo waliambiwa kwamba nyinyi chezea hapa. Meaning this is something that was planned early in advance na tunaletewa just for show off to waste our time and uh, to waste our precious time on the screens. But then <laughs> anyway Na hiyo ni Kenya. Niseme hivi kaka. Sharia ya Kenya is for the less fortunate. Wewe unaenda interview. Lakini kuna watu wanaenda interview as a formality. This country is unfair. And it all depends how you know people. It all depends the good rapport. You have created with people. Because. Katiba ya Kenya. Imetengenezewa wale wanyonge. Lakini the political class. The elite. Will always have their way. The ESCC case. Cannot affect Oparanya from the appointment. He has already been told how to respond. He has already responded. So. It is going to have a little impact on his nomination. God bless you, ladies and gentlemen. See you in the next video. Asante Nisan.